Over across the country is slowing down New Year's Day travel plans. 4029's Emily Maha live tonight at XNA to give us an update on your flights. Daniel, things here at the airport are a little bit quiet. You can see people getting ready to get on their flight. But take a look at the arrivals and departures board. You can see there's a handful of flights that have been delayed. Our longest layover is four hours, so we'll have should have plenty of time, and I'm not worried about missing a flight at that point. But not everyone is so lucky. We saw about a half dozen flights delayed today. Workers at XNA tell us most of those delays happened because crews had to de-ice the planes. Right now, the 7 p.m. flight from Chicago has been delayed. We fly from XNA to Newark, um, New Jersey, and then Newark to Tel Aviv. Their final destination? But we're going to go to Jerusalem to visit family. Right now, the flight Luke and Sarah Pasco are about to take isn't delayed, but that could change. We uh -huh. use Kayak a lot. It's one of the many cell phone apps you can use to keep track of your flight. Just to see if their flights have connected or if they're delayed. And right now, there are only three more flights that are scheduled to take off tonight, and none of those flights have been delayed. Live in Bentonville, Emily Maha, 4029 News. All right, thank you, Emily. Well, right now, the airports in Dallas and Denver are leading the way with the most delayed flights in the country. Dallas has more.